Do you want to sell your coins, paper money, notes, valuable bills and stamps online? You can publish your ads for free on our website, thecoines.com. For mobile users it's much easier publishing coin ads using our Coines app. Hey coin collectors! Welcome back to Coines. This is 1962 D. Washington Quarter in Mint State 67. Superb gem with CAC certification. It is a paradox of certain issues late in the Silver Washington Quarter series that while they were minted in far greater quantities than many of their predecessors, in some cases they are unavailable in the same high grades. Pale glints of gold and lemongrass patina settle over otherwise silver surfaces with booming luster. A touch of striking distortion is noted on the word IN from the motto IN God We Trust. Sold for $16,450 at Heritage Auctions. This is 1923's Lincoln Penny in MS65 red condition. The 1923 South Lincoln Center claims a relatively small mintage of 8.7 million pieces and few high-quality specimens were saved by contemporary numismatists. In addition, the 1923s was not a well-produced issue. David Lang notes, mushy coins from worn dyes are the rule for the 1923s. Accordingly, the 1923s is an elusive issue in MS65 condition, and gems with a sharp strike and red surfaces are rare. This highly elusive example ended up selling for $33,600 at Heritage Auctions. Moving on with this 1928D Mercury dime with full bands on reverse. Graded in Mint State 67 by PCGS. This full bands 1928D Mercury dime showcases exemplary preservation, frosty luster, and spectacular sharpness across each side. Golden toning lightens toward the centers, leaving the borders with a deeper amber hue. This lovely toned gem was bargained for $36,000 at Heritage Auctions. Here is 1917 Lincoln Penny with doubled ID obverse. Graded in mint state 65 red and brown by PCGS. Slightly faded mint red and attractive for this exceedingly rare issue. Boldly struck with clear doubling on the 9, 7, and trust. For the Lincoln Cent Collector, this is one of the premier rarities in the entire series, and a coin which is difficult to find in any grade. This desirable guidebook variety is described in Cherry Pickers as certainly one of the top five Lincoln Cent varieties. Sold for $14,950 at Heritage Auctions. Moving on to this 1947S Roosevelt dime in Mint State 68 with spectacular visual appeal. Truly superlative coin, this piece earned the MS68 grade and full torch designation. In addition, this example displays spectacular toning. The obverse exhibits rich golden orange toning overall, with areas of blue green at the upper and lower portions. The reverse displays even stronger visual appeal, with hues of blue green, sunset orange, violet, and pale green. A cluster of vertical dye polish lines appears at left on the reverse. Sold for $4,406.25 at Heritage Auctions. And this is 1954's Jefferson Nickel with full steps. Uncert gem in MS66 condition. The 1954s Jefferson Nickel MS66 Full Steps is a high-grade coin that is sought after by collectors. It is considered rare because only a few examples of this coin are known to exist in this grade with full steps. The full steps designation refers to the sharpness of the steps on the Monticello building on the reverse side of the coin. This is an important factor for collectors because it indicates that the coin was struck with a high level of precision. In general, the value of the 1954s Jefferson Nickel MS66 full steps is determined by its condition and rarity. This one was sold for $11,812.50 including buyer's fee at Great Collections Auction. Thanks for watching guys. Your likes and subscriptions are highly appreciated. And if you have rare coins you can post them for sale on our website, thecoines.com. Take care.